What is going on my YouTube family? Welcome back to the Gaming Brigade and as most of you know by now with the introduction of Title Update 20 we saw a bunch of different buffs to weapons all across the board and that includes a handful of ARs so as we roll into the weekend I wanted to highlight one of my new favorite weapons in the game it is the Shield Splinterer. Now to be clear to the best of my knowledge you can acquire that weapon by either defeating all of the year one hunters or you can get the blueprint from a reconstructed cache and descent. I'm pretty sure those are the only two ways. Now at this point we're going to jump Right into the build breakdown I will show you a different weapon you can use in the meantime if you do not have this one and as always my fellow agents we are going to start with the specialization you can see I'm using gunner and the main reason for that is because that is going to give us access to the banshee pulse which will disorient enemies so if you happen to want to be more aggressive with your gameplay that will definitely help you out you also have a rate of fire increase armor on kill reload speed increase as well and remember regardless of which specialization you choose have the proper weapons activated in your your weapon skill tree that way you're getting a 15% weapon damage bonus regardless of which one you're using now as I said a moment ago my primary for this build is the shield splinterer you can see him at proficiency rank zero I've never really touched this thing but the main reason I'm looking forward to using it now is because not only did they increase the RPM by 50 they added 10 bullets to the mag and it has the talent perfect optimist weapon damage is increased by 4% for every 10% ammo missing from the magazine now that talent does take a little getting used to if you're like me and there's any break in the action whatsoever you immediately want to reload but with this talent you do not want to do that you want to let the magazine completely empty out and for those of you out there who do not have this in the meantime you can use any f2000 or f2000 replica as those did receive the same buffs as the shield splinterer and feel free to put the regular talent optimist on one of those that will still get the job done my secondary for this build is the Dark Winter SMG, one of my favorite weapons in the game. It has the talent Perfect Killer. Killing an enemy with a crit hit grants 50% crit hit damage for 10 seconds. That is a lifetime in this game. However, feel free to put the weapon of your choosing in that spot. It is totally up to you, my friends. Moving on to the gear, we have four Striker, one Grupo, and one Overlord. Starting with the mask, it is the first of four pieces of the Striker gear set. We're running all four so we get all of the gear set bonuses. Two pieces, 15% weapon handling. Three pieces, 15% percent rate of fire four pieces strikers gamble weapon hits increase total weapon damage by 0.65 percent stacking up to 100 times and on every piece of gear i'm trying to stack crit hit chance and crit hit damage everywhere i can that is now going to take us to the body armor it's the one piece of grupo that gives us 15 percent extra crit hit damage and it has the talent unbreakable when your armor is depleted repair 95 percent of your armor the cooldown is 60 seconds and for me it allows me to change up my play style anytime i want i can play from cover or if i want to be more aggressive that will definitely help you out just like the banshee pulse moving on to the holster it's a second piece of striker again stacking crit hit chance or crit hit damage right after that we have the fox's prayer knee pads we are using those because it has that middle attribute eight percent damage to targets out of cover that's one of the best ones in the game finally we have the gloves and the backpack they are the final two pieces of the striker gear set and because we are wearing the striker bag we get the talent risk management and that is going to increase total weapon damage gain per stack of strikers gain from 0.65% to 1%. Last but not least, we have the skills. I'm using the Banshee Pulse, like I said before, as well as the Assault Drone, because it is a great distraction to NPC and puts out damage as well. As far as my stats are concerned, you can see I'm sitting at 56% crit hit chance. Remember, the max is 60 and 107.4 crit hit damage. Remember, those numbers are going to be dependent on not only the gear you have equipped, but having a Shade Watch of level 1000. Most of you know that one of my favorite aspects about putting these build videos together is the family that we have here at the channel so if you happen to have any tips or tricks you want to pass along to new and returning players please let me know as the main goal is to help out as many people as possible that is going to do it for this one my friends i will leave you with some gameplay footage however as always i want to take a moment and thank you all for your incredible support of this channel i sincerely appreciate the privilege of your time and as i mention at the end of every one of these take care of yourselves be kind to each other and we will talk to you soon Thanks again, everyone. Got a visual on additional hostiles in the Memorial compound. They're moving south. There's a gate between you. It looks closed from here. Agent, you'll need to find a way to open that gate.
is all clear. Uh, that can't be all of them. Check the interior while I get Henry's people to maintain the perimeter. into a base. It's an area beneath you with increased security. Isaac can't access data on this location. Stay alert. I don't know what you're walking into. Team from the campus has taken position inside the memorial. If you hadn't stopped them, I know they would have used those weapons on us, and we would have ended up like Castle. I can't tell you how relieved I am to have you on our side. Thank you. Today, we dealt a great blow to the True Sun's infrastructure. We confiscated a massive cache of chemical weapons and eliminated a stronghold near the campus. You should be proud. You saved a lot of lives today. 